Hi everyone, I'm Cheryl McColgan, founder of Peel Nourish Grow, and today I want to share with you one of my very favorite winter treats. So even though my maiden name was Schnellenberger, very German, right, I had never had Glühwein until I was part of the snowboard culture. And how I came into contact with Glühwein is because after you've spent all day on the slopes, it might be a little cold, and so you come down afterwards and you go to a cool little hut or a bar, and you get a hot beverage to warm up. And Glühwein is very, very popular in the Alps and Switzerland and France and Austria. And so I became really just enamored with this wonderful drink. But here's the challenge, right? Traditionally, Glühwein is very sugary. So there's um, sugar added to the wine. It's, they use mulling spices. So it's a very um, delicious, comforting, warm kind of winter drink, but it does have quite a bit of sugar. So today I'm going to show you how to make a keto friendly version. And this is going to be so ridiculously easy, but it's so wonderful. I'm going to enjoy this tonight when we're decorating our tree that we got a little early this year, because you know, if you're watching this later, it's 2020. <laughs> and so we got it a little early just to kind of bring a little more holiday cheer. So along with that holiday cheer tonight, when we're decorating the tree, it's going to be this wonderful glue vine. So you just need a few, uh, kind of traditional mulling spices, which I will show you obviously in the recipe, and a bottle of very dry red wine. I prefer, as you know, dry farm wines, my very favorite. Um, you can go check out my other video that does a whole review of their wines, but it's tested for so many things and also less than one gram of sugar in the entire bottle. So that's a very key component in making a really nice keto-friendly glue vine. So let's get started.